I'm Matt from Orasma, and what we're showing here is a simple app called Orasma Lite, which is the world's first visual browser. It's really cool, and it's really cool because it's only just become possible. So because of the technical advancements in these mobile phones, because of the incredible GPUs and CPUs that companies like Arm are able to, to create, we can make a mobile phone understand objects in the real world. And what's really unique about Orasma is it can detect up to 500,000 on each device. Once it's detected the object, it can then track it through a full three dimensions and make that thing interactive and clickable. So you've got all sorts of things. You've got people putting instructional videos on routers. You've got people tagging up the insides of um, engines on cars with explanations on what the different things do. Uh, you've got teachers who've tagged up their classrooms with amazing footage of their kids explaining these really beautiful pictures that they've created. Through to advertisers who do really creative things. So you've got LucasAid bottles which explode and come to life with the artist's creation. You've got Blue Dragon um, Oriental food products which when you point at them you get recipes and ideas of which other products you should buy with it. It's a practical use of augmented reality. You know, it's, it's showing that AR for the first time can be used in everyday life to find information out uh, in a more convenient and practical way. And what's really exciting is you've also got cinema partners who are doing really amazing things with it. So we have companies like Universal Pictures, Sony Columbia, TriStar, Paramount Pictures who are going in and, and doing things like trailers on the, on the top of things like train stations, um, on billboards, where actually the characters from the films are going to jump out and then entertain you.